Welcome back to the channel. We have a new season of Call of Duty Mobile, which brings a new gun, which is the Odin. It's an AR rifle, and this thing has absolutely broken the game. It is a two shot, and that's up to 30 meters as well. So it's gonna be very interesting. A lot of players are probably gonna be picking up this gun, and it's very easy to use too. So if you're a beginner and you want a hard hitting gun, as long as you hit upper body shots, you're gonna get a two shot kill, and even three shot if you do hit some of the lower parts of the body. And the recoil is a slow upward bounce, so it's quite easy to manage. So I think if you're a player that likes to take a lot of mid-range gunfights this is going to be the ideal gun for you and the great thing is you can get this gun for free because it comes out at tier 21 for free at the battle pass but if you do buy the battle pass you get this awesome megalodon skin at tier 50 and i really like this because the blueprint has a really nice iron sight with this megalodon skin so the build that i got here was a mid-range build and i went with the colossus suppressor giving us a silenced weapon also the increase in the damage range by 40 percent now the ads speed isn't the fastest on this gun so i went with the owc tactical laser to give it a boost also combining that with the YKM combat stock to give us an extra increase of 12% ADS speeds. Also to increase the bullet spread accuracy, we've got the granular grip tape. Then I went with the extended mag A, which gives us five extra rounds, bringing the magazine to 25. I usually like to rock ARs with at least 30 rounds, but I think this is all right as the damage is so high on this weapon. If you go with the duplex rounds, they do have a slight less damage but it's not that much you'll still get a two tap at certain ranges i didn't really see any benefit using the pellet it didn't really seem like it had any difference in the bullet spread but overall i think this gun is probably too overpowered and it's probably going to need to be nerfed but let me know what you guys think is this gun too powerful or is it just right in the meta let me know in the comments thank you guys for watching and if you haven't subscribed now's a good time to do so we make call of duty and mobile content on the channel thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video peace